Hi everyone, today I want to talk about uh, positivity and how you keep your life as positive as possible or how you keep your thoughts as positive as possible. Um, in the past I've been guilty of um, thinking overly negative things and normally it was if I was failing at something or um, you know, I got a setback or there was so undue stress about something then I would assume that I would never be able to achieve it or and you know all other areas of my life were a failure as well and of course that's not true but um, it was the negative thoughts were then impacting negatively on my life so I've been lately I've been reading a book called Battlefield of the Mind by uh, Joyce Meyer and it's all about how to change your thoughts into being more positive and then therefore making your life more positive. Um, in the past I probably would have scoffed at this sort of thing thinking oh that's so airy fairy it would never like how can you have positive thoughts all the time but that's not the point the point is what you do with the thoughts um, once you have them thoughts will um, sort of like bubbles that come through your head and like whether you pay any attention to it or not is a choice and how you let it the thought affect your life is a choice so viewing a setback as a failure isn't going to be a positive thing in, in life seeing it however as a challenge or um, as an opportunity to prove yourself is a far more positive way to look at uh, some sort of setback or failure or whatever you know you don't want to see it as the end you want to see it as a challenge so I think I'm much, I was, yeah, I suppose, growing older and stuff as well, but also that it, having a training mindset helps because I'm just trying to relate this back to training because everything has sort of started to make sense because I know I can set myself challenges and I know that um, I can achieve much more than I ever thought possible and I can look back and see all the things I have overcome, which helps um, to reassure me that I have the ability and I have the inner strength to deal with uh, future stresses and you know you may need to withdraw and you know things do get on top of you and that's that's fine it's not a weakness um, strength comes from recognizing um, where you where it needs attention in your life and giving it that attention and uh, trying to overcome it that is actually a strength and uh, being able to um, understand that it's a strength is a huge part of it and not feeling like you're failing at life um, so um, some ways to make my thoughts more positive. I mean, if something bad happens, then uh, you sort of have to make the sort of best out of a bad situation, sort of thing. So what I do is try to make my actions and words, etc., inspiring, um, so empowering, humble is very important. Being uh, humble is very important, and also have um, thoughts with positive purpose. Or actions with a positive purpose. Um, not all thoughts will be positive initially um, because you do get negative things coming into your head but it's what you do with it like I said so they have to have a positive purpose in the future you're wanting to turn that around. Um, I read something I get the sort of captions and things coming on Facebook quite often and I collect some of them that I like and here's one um, strength doesn't come from winning your struggles develop your strengths uh, when you go through hardships and decide not to surrender that is strength so that's kind of echoing what I'm saying see it as an opportunity to prove yourself and as a challenge um, so last week I got a good response on the topic of motivation and this week I'm hoping to do the same to get a little bit of discussion or just um, a few posts from yourselves about techniques um, that you, you have that help you um, overcome negativity. I think that's a good way of putting it or overcoming uh, setbacks or you know you don't reach a goal or you're under a lot of stress and you're you're feeling that everything is falling apart how do you overcome that so um, post your comment on my blog myomytv.com and I look forward to reading your feedback so until next time I, oh, I will be back soon with a new workout um, but until next time enjoy this and I'll see you soon